Hey guys, 8-Bit RJ here in the world of 8-Bit Rollercoin bringing you a super fast how-to tutorial on purchasing a parts crate from the Season Store and then putting those parts onto the marketplace and earning yourself some RLT. So keep watching. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is drop into the Season Store and we're going to click up here straight into the season store and this is the common part case which we're going to purchase so we click buy buy and we've got ourselves 600 common wires okay so we've got our parts what to do with them now so obviously we want to go straight to the marketplace this is where we're going to sell our items so Personally, what I would suggest first is go into the buy section, then click parts, click common, and then click on, we've got wires. Uh, the only thing is you're gonna find with wires is because wires uh, basically occur the most often when you purchase a crate that they're probably gonna be one of the things that is gonna be a very slow mover when it comes to selling. Obviously, if you've got, if you're lucky enough to get like hashing boards or fans, uh, they are going to sell a lot faster on the market because they don't come up as often as common wires. But we got common wires, so that's what we're going to work with. So you click on here, and then basically you can see here in the listings that uh, you've got 599 at. 0.0012 and then from that point they go up okay and um, so it's up to you whether you go for the lowest price or you go for somewhere in the middle or the highest price or whatever the way I look at it is the fact that the idea of selling the parts through from the east to basically accrue some RLT as fast as possible so personally what I would probably suggest is go for the lowest part lowest the lowest price at like say 300 we got 600 so 300 at the lowest price and then maybe uh, another 300 at the next highest price or even you know so 13 now is actually the highest price uh, and then we could maybe do 300 of that and then 300 at 15 uh, or you could stagger it throughout all the prices do do 100 here, 100 there, 100 there, 100 there, and do it that way, uh, you know, but it is entirely up to you. So what we're going to do is if we click sell, we click on our common wires. If you notice that the price again changed, uh, there was someone had just put 500 on at 0 0.0012. So what we're going to do is we're going to use that as a guide. So we're going to put 0 0.0012 and then we're going to put 300. Uh, and then we're gonna set, we're gonna sell that. Agree, sell. Okay, and then view your listings, and you can see here that is the first listing that we've done. And then we're gonna go uh, sell again. And then we're gonna sell the other uh, three hundred. And, but I'm going to do it at a slightly higher price. So one four three hundred, and then we're going to click sell again. And view listings, and there you go. So basically, that is the that is the way of doing it. That's a uh, dead simple. It's dead simple. It works uh, very easily. Uh, you can see that it didn't really take much uh, in the way of sorting out. Obviously, like I say, if you're selling anything, first go into the buy section and check out your prices because you want to be competitive. At the end of the day, the idea is to uh, earn some RLT for your account as fast as possible. But I wouldn't really undercut anyone. I wouldn't really go really low because then you're sort of um, doing yourself out of RLT. I would just look at the lowest price and probably match that. And then like you saw with... Uh, the other 300 go a little higher because as ones get sold 
then they're going to come, you know, some at some point is going to get to the point where your slightly higher price is in fact the lowest price on the market. So you're going to benefit from that slightly higher price at some point. But like I say, throw them on the marketplace. All you got to do is um, to check on them, come into the marketplace section and then go to my orders. And then you can just see how well they're getting on. If we come out go into here and then quickly go back see if anything has changed uh no so we still not sold anything but that is it that's all i wanted to show you so i hope that was helpful and informative and if you could smash that like button it really does support my channel which then helps me make more content to help you so take care have a great rest of your weekend and i'll speak to you soon thanks a lot bye